In my opinion, Frank Matthews was a much larger drug dealer than Frank Lucas. In 1971, Frank Matthews first came on the police radar, but only by luck. Well, it was rather peculiar. I had a report from some precinct that there was some unusual going on in the apartment building in uh, Brooklyn. This was going on, and Kowalski comes along. He was living at 130 Clarkson Avenue in Brooklyn, which incredibly, could you imagine this, was the same building, apartment building, that Frank Matthews was living in. Well, this guy is complaining that there's all the parking places around his house on the weekends are all taken up by out-of-state cars all going into one apartment. <laughs> 